you know i'm going to get some really nice steak and mashed potatoes with the broccoli you know i have a nice lychee martini like this is the type of vibe what is going on you guys welcome back to my channel and if you are new and you've never seen my face before hi my name is ash and this is my channel living ash i hope that you guys are doing well i decided today i was gonna do like a little sit down just talk with you guys i normally like always have a theme for videos and now this one's kind of on a theme i guess or a specific talking point i guess but more so just talking about what i'm doing today so in today's video i'm gonna be sharing with you guys my opinions on some of the new perfumes that have come out now this year 2022 we have gotten so many perfume releases and as a perfume lover myself of course i had to get them now i don't always like to buy perfume just to buy perfume okay i like to actually like what i'm picking up but sometimes i can be a little bit impulsive i do like to just buy things and i'm like oh i like it i want it you know but then i'm like ah do i even love this as much so i'm gonna give you guys my full take on these fragrances and just kind of talk to you guys about again what i'm doing today because today is going to be super fun or it could be super intimidating or it could be super uh i don't know it could just could be a life-changing experience i don't know but we have a sponsor for today's video it's bow optimizers so check them out right here and then we're going to talk about the fragrances in this video of course i have to mention today's sponsor bio optimizers if you've been following me for a while i always talk about them because i take these supplements daily bio optimizers has completely changed a lot of my routine especially when sleeping i told you guys recently actually that i've struggled with sleeping through the night and i've been using bio optimizers magnesium breakthrough to really help me with that i take this with my evening meal every single night and oh my gosh i'm so much more relaxed magnesium really helps to support sleep it also helps to reduce stress levels and it really helps you sleep through the night and that's been my major issue waking up periodically throughout the night and as you know i've been on my weight loss journey just trying to tone and get more muscle mass so i've been taking the mass times from bio optimizers as well but what i thought was really cool that i have from them is the veg slimes so these are plant-based and they actually support plant-based digestion so if you're on a plant-based diet i would recommend you guys get the veg slimes i highly recommend you try the veg slimes i've never talked about these before so i'm so happy to share them with you and of course guys if you are transitioning or you are in a plant-based diet i do recommend you try these mass times help simply to break down the protein in your food me personally i'm on a high protein diet so that requires me to eat a lot of protein and what your body does it actually works over time to process the protein making it easier to burn some fat you know so taking a mass times or like i am taking now veg times is really going to help with that and of course support muscle growth another thing i want to show you is p3om which is awesome because i do recommend every single day that you're taking some sort of probiotic and this one here is a very powerful probiotic this also helps support your immune system and also helps to aid in digestion as well so this is perfect all around i usually take this at night and then i'll go ahead and take my magnesium these two are perfect for nighttime and with this right here the veg times you can take this once or twice a day with your meals perfect addition i just keep them right by me and then i just take them personally i recommend you try all three supplements go to buy optimizers everything for buy optimizers will be in the description down below so you can check out everything they have so many products to choose from seriously you're gonna have a ball on the website just looking at the products that you want to try especially when you're trying to get into a more healthy lifestyle and good news if you order today everything is completely risk-free that's because buy optimizers actually offers a one-year money-back guarantee if for any reason you're not happy you can always send your unopened bottle back you have up to 365 days money back guarantee i have a code here on the screen it's ash 10 you get 10 percent off if you use my code i know you guys love a discount i love a discount use the code it's here on the screen it'll also be down in the description box below a lot of you guys have actually told me that you guys have liked bio optimizers and that you guys are looking to purchase so again use that code right here check it out thank you so much bio optimizers for sponsoring today's video and last thing i have to say i always want to say this especially when i'm talking about supplements it's never too late to start taking supplements every single day to improve your health and make this the healthiest year that you've ever had so again thank you by optimizers for sponsoring today's video i love them so much you guys already know like i've been using them for a while let's talk about it let's talk about it and let me see i'm gonna have to adjust my lighting a little bit because i'm telling you guys i'm in south florida and i keep looking into this lens so i live in south florida and um it's been raining a lot lately like it's been like ugly outside and i'm a person that really thrives when the sun is out so when the sun isn't out i'm like looking for energy and like i have to go within for real to like be my best self because the sun is not out okay and i have this book now it's funny it's in my bed <sighs> this book it's called uh pieces every step yeah pieces every step it's the path of mindfulness in every day 
Uh, I'm an avid reader. I like to read a lot of books. This is kind of like just finding peace in every moment, not needing to like go away for peace. You know, like a lot of us have to go on like vacation. We gotta be like, you know, out of our normal element to feel like we can be peaceful. But the book is really teaching me to like be able to have peace within this moment right now. Like even if I'm at work, I'm at the desk, whatever it is, I'm practicing to, you know, just be happy and peaceful in any moment in my life. So it is taking some work, but it's working. Okay, anyway, so today I'm going to my first ever influencer event. Me, yes, I'm so excited. I'm grateful and I'm really, really excited to the point where I'm already ready and um, it's 307. So it starts at six. Um, I'm probably gonna share what it's like over on TikTok or Instagram or maybe YouTube stories here. I forget to post on YouTube stories, like I just forget. Um, and I'm excited. So obviously I got dressed up. I'm wearing this dress. It's from Zara. Zara for the win. Like, it's Zara. Duh. And my fragrance of the day is Killian Rolling in Love. I almost said love don't be shy because we all love her. This is one of my favorite Killian fragrances. I honestly just got this maybe like last month. Not even. And I mean of all the perfume that I have, like I've used that much of it. And for me that's a lot. Because I mean, well, I do have dents in a lot of my fragrances. Like I really be using my stuff. So I really love this. I sprayed this all over me. As my body oil, I used the Flower Bomb Victor & Rolf. I'm so sorry. I don't think they sell this anymore, but if you ever find it, I love it. I've used this much of it since I got it. I think I showed you guys when I purchased it, and it's been super good. I feel like there's a vanilla note in the Victor & Rolf fragrances, so I've been like obsessed. So these two kind of go well together. I always like to put on a nice perfumed body oil when I'm heading out, wherever I'm going, honestly, but like to an event like this? You know I gotta step out, okay? That's just what it is. So talking about some things that I like as far as perfume releases, um, the first one, I talked about this in a video, maybe like the end of a vlog. It's the Ellis Brooklyn Vanilla Milk. This right here, I feel like got a lot of hate, okay? And I wouldn't even say hate, because hate is a very strong word, but a lot of people don't like this. And I'm not gonna lie, I am not like so super duper, I'm in love, this is the best perfume I ever bought. No, I'm, when I saw it, I knew right off the bat, like the bottle was pretty, the name was pretty. If you're a vanilla lover like me, you're gonna like vanilla scents. I mean, whatever, I'm like, whatever has vanilla, I want it. So that's really what drew me to it. I definitely would say, do not blind buy this. I think I told y'all that in the other video, but if you didn't see it, I'm telling you now. Do not blind buy this. I don't think this is blind buy worthy. Go to the store. For me I didn't have that option available they did not have it in stores yet and so I just ordered it and this was quite the price okay but if I'm honest it's different it's very bourbon vanilla like when you're at the fireside type and I'm not gonna lie I would not blind by this like ugh, it's different <laughs> it's definitely different I would say maybe layer this with something else I'm wondering if I layer it with like another sweet type vanilla scent if it would smell super good don't know but if you're a super sweet vanilla girl like ash yeah but the bottle though vanilla milk how they got us with this but ellis brooklyn i think if they came out with a sweet vanilla something a little bit more this one's really strong like this is definitely unisex in my opinion anyone can wear this but the bottle was nice i think the name was good i think the scent just i don't know they love to trick us people who like vanilla they do so I made a little like reels <laughs> on TikTok and Instagram or no no what is it YouTube shorts y'all so I went and picked this up I was like having a long day so I was like I'm going to Bath and Body Works and I went ahead and got this this is the pumpkin pie now I was confused whether it was sweet potato pie or pumpkin pie but to me it could be whatever you want it's supposedly a pumpkin pie pocket bag holder i really really like it personally uh i do recommend you guys get it because i always collect these and you guys know if you've been watching for a while the scent that i have in here is the toasted vanilla chai hence the vanilla again and then you have this cute little pocket bag holder someone did comment and say they wish it was like on the side where the hand sanitizer was but honestly i mean it is what it is like i know the bath and body works employees kind of wear their stuff like this so i can see why it'd probably be cuter on the side so that it can kind of lay flat so you can see the whole thing but i'm just letting you know this is available in the stores and um go get it and if you haven't peeped my hair the braids are back and i was like waiting to put color back in my hair 
personally I used to wear braids all the time and the reason I decided to get braids again is because I was wearing tapins for about three months I would do like my maintenance keep up with them you know whatever but I was like you know what I'm kind of like wanting to give my hair a little break and I have been seeing braids all over and I'm like what the heck like normally we go for the braids in the summer but it's the fall and I'm seeing more braids and I monkey see monkey do I was like I'm getting my braids back and I really love it you know I don't always love fresh braids so I'm like I just got it yesterday but oh girl when they start getting a little bit more flexible and I can put it up and all that it's not super tight but I love my braids these are knotless box braids um, I use expression hair if y'all are interested in knowing and this is the number 30 so anyways on to the next so the next one here is the Prada paradox this was sent to me. Thank you so much, Prada, for sending this over to me. I'm going to tell you the truth. Everyone's been asking me what I thought since I already did like an unboxing on a TikTok and everything. I think this is dope. However, when I smelled this, I definitely was thinking of like Giorgio Armani, my way. I was thinking of YSL Libre. I was thinking of some of my heavy hitter fragrances that are really, really dope. This, it doesn't smell like something I haven't smelled before, but if you're looking for something, again, the bottle was very pretty. This is like one of those things you'd probably want to buy for the bottle. When you like lay it down on your perfume stand, it's going to sit like sideways like this. It's very strong. It's going to be something that is going to stay on you for a little minute. I don't know if it's beast mode as a fragrance, but it's it's very very strong and if you spray it on your clothes it's gonna really just stick and hug onto your body real tight so I would say this is really nice if you're looking for a nice designer fragrance type this this is dope I like it I do like it a lot um, and I would say again um, everything I'm talking about right now I wouldn't say blind buy you know what this is the one thing I was saying but they don't have it anymore the, this body oil but I want you guys to actually go to the store and smell these things I don't recommend blind buying I, I mean I used to be and still am a big buy, blind buyer because you know I mean I just do this on YouTube and like I want to just get things fast and I don't really have time to like do all that but I'm gonna tell y'all I always want you guys to go smell things for yourself because all of us like different things but this is really good like if this it, when I tell you how I feel this is date night on the water on a boat my man's taking me to get some sushi you know I'm going to get some really nice steak and mashed potatoes with the broccoli you know I have a nice lychee martini like this is the type of vibe this fragrance is giving me so yeah I do like it and I would say get it or smell it that's what I mean okay on to the next one we have right here this one is the Burberry Her Elixir. I got this I didn't even give it a second chance I was just like let me go get it because I gotta tell my girls about it and um I am not in love with this one right here. I know. I don't know. I'm, I promise you, because I have this Burberry here. And if you guys want to know the ounces, I don't ever get big, 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 big bottles. I don't need those. This one's a 1.6, and then this one's also 1.6. And I mean, I've had this for a very long time. I haven't finished it, so that's really the reason I don't buy humongous bottles. I don't need that. But... I prefer the regular Burberry and this is the elixir which means at least what the associate told me the elixir is like way higher than the EDP it's like up there and like in Macy's I think they said they only have like two elixir fragrances or even just one and it's this so this is supposed to be long-lasting it's gonna stick on you forever that's what the lady was saying now some people felt like this was very juvenile and I just sprayed the other one on here um and I you know what I don't like to say that because everyone likes different things so that's not what I would use to describe my fragrances like oh this one's like for kids or whatever like someone said it's giving strawberry pound cake from Bath and Body Works because I believe one of the notes is strawberry but when you, oh wait, it smells nice, but that strawberry note gives me a little bit of like an artificially, like when I used to, honest, yeah, I guess when I used to play with like my dolls, like they had this like artificial scent, like they would, like one of them was maybe like a strawberry patch doll, something like that. And she was like a straw, or maybe strawberry shortcake doll. She always had like this strawberry scent and it's given that, but I would get this, if you're gonna get this, one, try it first. And then two, um, I would say get a sample, wear it, and see how you like it, and then we can, like, buy it. You know what I'm saying? But, like, for me, I don't see me wearing this, like, all day as my own, like, regular fragrance. I think, for me, I'd, like, you know, wear something else. Like, I'd put, a, like, something else on, 
because I have it now so I'm not gonna get rid of it but I like it it's just not I'm not in love with it and I wanted to give you my thoughts on it um, but I want you to smell it I want you to have your own opinion please let me know what you think because again this is very very hyped up on the internet but again it's not all about hype for me I really genuinely want to know if this fragrance is gonna be something that I'm gonna be happy wearing and for me fragrances can make me feel happy they can bring me back to a time like it's all of that so just keep that in mind like seriously I, I mean that from the bottom of my heart I just want to know like how are you guys doing physically mentally um I wanted this to not just be so focused on fragrance but kind of like just catching up like girl talk um if you want to know about me I've been really good just kind of focusing on one my peace because peace has been something that is not necessarily it just doesn't come to me like super easy like i have to really focus because one thing about my mind it's like a cassette tape just rolling like it does not stop um and also i've been reading a lot so i've been reading colleen hoover books um shout out to the internet like tiktok and all that because they put me onto books i've been reading so you y'all want to know about this it ends with us so i'm on like page what 160 i'm on chapter 12 okay so i'm pretty much almost done with the book i mean i believe there's only like 50 oh there, okay there's like 33 chapters jesus there's a lot but i mean i'm halfway through the book i'm about page like 160 something i really like it so far i know i like it because i would not read it that far like i know when i like a book and i'm not gonna keep going with the book if i don't like it so it ends with us i do recommend it it's a little raunchy here and there but it's it's pretty pg but it's good i like it a lot and then i just got this right now in the mail like before i started filming and, and this one is called uh reminders of him so i am going to be starting this one soon right after this one so again books have been something i've been really focused on like when i was doing my hair yesterday i was there like just reading my books just kind of like taking the time to do that instead of scrolling on the phone being on the internet like it's so much like i feel like sometimes we consume too much content on tiktok and like uh instagram and shout out to y'all if you don't have social media how do you do it like i mean if i wasn't a content creator i probably wouldn't either like i probably wouldn't be on here like not on youtube but like on tiktok and instagram because i think too much content is too much for us but um yeah i've been good i'm going to this event later and did my hair uh update on my loneliness i'm gonna hopefully meet some new friends tonight so hopefully that goes well still single rocking it i have my friend's birthdays today shout out to brie happy birthday to you <laughs> i'm trying to think of like what is new in my life honestly nothing's really new y'all i've just been doing my thing so that's just really the updates um yeah i've been on my weight loss journey go i'm gonna put I'm gonna post it on my vlog channel today. I have a video going up on there. Uh, that's gonna be about my tea that I've been drinking. So it's at the Ash Life. Go subscribe over there after this video. It's it should be up. Like I just need to do the thumbnail, whatever. So yeah, I'm gonna be posting on there soon. That's where I'm gonna be posting like more personal, like everyday things. So make sure you're over there so you can check me. So this fragrance right here, let's talk about it. Maison Francis Kirk John 724, okay? Um, either 724 or 724, whatever. Um, this right here, I rush to get because I love fresh laundry type scents. This is, in my opinion, it's my opinion. I don't know if you guys ever saw that. In my opinion with this fragrance, it is like very similar to something i already have i feel like this smells like the fresh laundry from the clean brand um i feel like i have this already and if i didn't um it just smells like a fresh laundry detergent this is not a blind buy worthy in my opinion either um it's so clean and fresh though and i don't want to call it a gym scent because that's not fair because i feel like gym scents we don't really always try to go too crazy and this is a pretty penny to just wear to the gym okay but I'm going to tell you that it smells like laundry detergent. It smells like fresh washed clothes with like a really good fragranced detergent. It is something that you could spray on your clothes. But I don't know if this is something you'd want to wear for date night. I think, I don't, yeah, it's a little bit kind of like, uh, where do you wear this to? That's what I'm getting with this. Like, this could be a good everyday scent. But do you want to wear this to work? Do you want people to smell? Like, you could spray this on your clothes for the day, and then I think you could add another fragrance on top. But for the price point, you want to make sure you really, really love fresh and clean scents. But I like those scents. 
but I don't think like tonight I'm going out to an event like this is not what I was thinking to wear just being so real with you so here it is straight up seven two four by Maison Francis I'm gonna buy Baccarat Rouge the X straight version I'm thinking to probably get that today because Saks Fifth Ave is actually having a like sale and I could tell you guys what that is right now that is okay so you have I'm gonna put it on the screen so you have $35 and you get you get a $35 gift card if you spend $250 $75 if you spend a $500 honestly y'all I don't know who's spending $3,000 unless y'all gonna go buy a bag and you get $700 back in a gift card so that's not bad I mean if you got $3,000 and just drop at Saks today be my guest baby but yeah this right here is pretty but I don't know where you'd wear it I mean if you guys have suggestions for where you'd wear like a laundry detergent, very clean, soapy, clean girl aesthetic type fragrance, let me know because I need a little help with this one. My girlies, my girlies. And some of y'all be telling me you watch me and you're like talking to me and like your husbands are there. Shout out to y'all. I love you. Um, that really means something to me because I'm like, oh, you guys are with your man and like watching me. Like, I can't wait to have those days. Anyway, so I have the Aqua de Parma. This is the Rosa Nobile. Nobile? Nobile? I got this. This was not one of the new things that came out. I think, honestly, I think they gave me a defective bottle. Yeah, like it's not, I don't know if it's supposed to spray out like that. But I'm probably going to wear this like on my legs type. If you want to see my legs. Okay. Okay. Here's a shot. Hello. Um, But this is like a rose scent. And if you know me, I do not like rose. I don't think I've ever talked about rose scents on this channel before. Because I am not a rose fan. But this is very pretty. It has shimmer in it, but it's not too much shimmer. Um, I think if you pair this with the fragrance, it's going to be nice. But I got this on discount at Sephora during their like sale. So Aqua de Parma has these body oils. And what I loved about them is the fact that the body, uh, the bottle is very pretty. So that's really why I purchased this, to be honest with you. But so, since I got it for like 60 bucks, and I think normally it's like either 90 or something, I have to like look it up again. I was like, how do I pass this up? I can't. I've been eyeing this for a while. And I love good body oils. Like, if you look at this, look at how it looks just in my hand. It looks very luxurious. Like, you got, the camera doesn't want to do it justice. But, like, look at this. It's just very luxe. You got my um, Hermes <laughs> bracelet on. This one's from Coach here. But, like, I just really like the vibe. The vibe beginning, okay? It's the vibes for me. So, I've really talked about almost everything. I want to share my lip combo with you guys. This one's a Charlotte Tilbury Lip Cheat in the shade, I think this is Foxy Brown. And then I'm wearing the NYX, this is the Milk and Honey, because I love that, Milk and Honey. I believe there's a Milk and Honey in Washington, D.C. that I really love, or Maryland, I don't know which one. But it's so good, their food, strawberry biscuits, I've talked about that on my channel before. Obsessed, like if you haven't tried it, you need to, like I'm telling you. So, last things that I wanna mention, I have my Laura Mercier body cream. That's what I'm wearing today. Y'all, somebody commented saying about like a thank you I, that I mentioned the formula change. Yes, there's a formula change. Like, I'm going to show you. So, one of my all-time favorite perfumes. I never fail to get a compliment when I get this, when I wear this, I should say. So, you have the Laura Mercier Ombre Vanille and then you have the Vanille. You can see right here that there is literally two different types of labels. So if anything with this really like square label is the newer formula. These are not the same scent though. I'm just showing you like your this Ombre Vini looks like this now with this label. But this is my last old bottle and I've been saving it. I'll probably spray this on too because it adds a little vanilla spice to my outfit. So then this you can see here it has that little square out label here. And this does not last as long as the other body cream from back in the day. So Laura Mercier. I don't know what just happened with that but... Just saying, there is a formula change. So I decided to wear this body cream on my arms because why not? Like, I just love this one. And uh, I sprayed this. No, like, I went OD. So I wore this all over. But this is, like, in my hair type all over my fragrance mist. This is the Brazilian Cheriosa 68 Dragon Fruit. This one smells like Baccarat Rouge 540. Some of the girlies say no, but I say yes. I think it does. Like, for real. I'm obsessed. And then... Lastly, I made a feminine hygiene video. It's a video before the last video and I talked about chlorophyll and I talked about how I don't like the liquid drops. So I got these in the pill form. I only took them once so can't say these work better than the liquid but just an update on that. So if you haven't seen that video, check it out. 
It's my five feminine hygiene tips that every girl should know video that I put out. So chlorophyll and what if you don't know what this is, it's kind of like an internal deodorant. It does a lot. It clears the skin. There's so many benefits to taking chlorophyll daily. So this is the one I decided to get. And I'm looking over at all my stuff. If you guys want to see what I'm looking at, here's the stuff uh, right here. And <laughs> some of the stuff that I have just laid out, I kind of just pick them up and like show you guys what I'm talking about and everything. But that's really all that I had for you today. Just like perfumes and stuff. One thing about me, I sometimes turn off the fan just to film these videos because the fan kind of makes this like mm, sound and that's really annoying. But the makeup is giving, everything's giving. I don't know what I'm gonna do with my hair if I'm gonna just leave it like this or put it up or down. But I'm excited about this event. I will let you guys know how it goes. I need to leave out of here very soon. It's 328. It's gonna take me an hour and four minutes. It's in Miami. Y'all, it's in Miami. So that means I'm gonna have to leave here at like four to get there by like five and then get parking. It's probably gonna take me long. And it's a weekday, so there's traffic. So it's like I have to take three hours to leave the house. But thank God I'm already ready, right? Like, thank God. So yeah, I have my Chanel earrings in, you know, my bracelet. I have a JBW watch on. Like, I don't have any necklaces, y'all. I used to have a nice little uh, double CC because it wasn't like a real Chanel necklace. It was like, like you know, just something I bought and then they broke. So I don't have a necklace. But that's it, y'all. Thanks for chatting with me and sitting down. If you made it this far in the video, drop what your weekend plans are. Drop a heart. I'm giving you options here. Drop your scent of the day as always. Please always do that. Drop your favorite fragrance. Like say something nice. Let me know what's up. Um, and yeah, thank you guys for watching and being here with me. And if there's any other updates, anything you want to know, anything you want to talk about, let me know in the comments down below. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at ash220 underscore and TikTok at livingash20. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, my babies. I love you. I love you. Take care and uh, God bless. And make sure you guys check out Bye Optimizers in the description down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.